Hi everyone, good afternoon. Going off, everyone is doing good. Uh, I'm going to review uh, a veggie burger from a company called Butter Burger. And I'll show you the box. And this is what it looks like the box. And it's from, I guess it's from a regular meat company that sells, you know, regular burgers. And from, you know, I, I just, I don't know if I remember reading about this a while back, but I forgot about this burger and someone's telling me that this, this company has regular meat too. But um, this, this, this burger I'm going to um, eat in front of you and review is, is, is a vegan burger. And like I said, it says vegan friendly on it. You can see it, hopefully. And this is the box that came in, and this I'll show you the package. Is what it looks like before it's cooked. These are the summer, uh, you know, this with the uh, veggie burgers it looks like. It don't look like a meat burger. It looks like more of a, um, you know, bunch of uh, stuff put together. And it looks more plant based than like you see the Beyond Burger and the Pasta Burger. It looks like a real, an actual burger from an animal, but th these look it's more plant based. And this is what I had this one. This is the burger I'm going to eat in front of you. So I put it in toaster for like 20 minutes or so. I forgot to count already. I know it was 12 minutes and I had to redo it again for no 12 minutes, but I shut it off before it was done and I forgot what exactly was the second time around. But you figure it was like 20 minutes or so. So I'm going to eat it in front of you, like I said. And I'm going to have this. It's, it's on a pretzel roll, like you may have noticed. It was a pretzel roll. This is the, the pretzel, what the pretzel rolls look like. And it comes in this package. It's pretzel. And all vegan, of course. So I'm gonna eat the burger in front of you. I had one um, last week and it was all right. It wasn't the, the greatest. Maybe I had to cook a little bit longer. I'm not sure it's kind of soft, but uh, hopefully I put it in this time a little bit longer and uh, it tastes better. So I got ketchup on it, like you've probably seen. And I'm gonna eat, eat, take a bite of it and tell you how it tastes. And like I said, last week was all right, but uh, hopefully it tastes a bit better this, this week and it's being this more well done, so we'll see. So here we go. Okay, it tastes pretty much like last week. I think it's a little bit more done this week than last week, but it don't taste like a Beyond Burger or a Pasta Burger. It tastes like a, sort of like more a plant-based burger, like, you know, there's a bunch of vegetables and stuff like that. So there's corn in it. It's made out of soy and stuff like that. So if you don't can't eat soy, you can't have this, I assume. So, I mean, if, you, if you're all right with soy and stuff, whatever else like that, then you could have it. whatever ingredients is in here. See, let me see if I can see the ingredients in it. says black beans, rolled oats, water brown, flaxseed, potato, starch, diced celery, diced green bell pepper, diced red pepper, diced apples, diced carrots, broccoli, corn, potato flakes, animal soy, green peas, savory, flavor, Vegetable, carrots, celery, onion, yeast, extract, and so on, you know. So it's, 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 it contains soy on the bottom, so you know it, it has soy in it. So if you can't eat soy, you can't have this, I guess. But I mean, besides, if you can eat soy and everything, it's, it, it, so far the burger is pretty, it's not bad. It don't taste like meat, in my opinion, anyway. So it tastes pretty good. It's not bad. I'm going to take one more bite to give more, more of a review. It's not bad burger. It's good. If you if you're more if you're not into Beyond Burger and Pasta Burger, where they taste more like meat, this is the burger for you more. You know more or less. Even though it's from a company that sells regular meat, which I found out like last week. It's you know if you can't get your hands on a part a complete vegan company that you prefer to give their money to, this is I guess one of the options you could go for. But it's not bad. I could taste the corn in it and all stuff. You know, it's, it's good. It could be maybe even cooked more better, if you ask me. But I had it for like 20 minutes, so I don't know. But I mean, it's good. It's nothing bad. I mean, some people may not like it, and some people may this is delicious. To me, so far, it's 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 on the good side. So one more bite. Here we go.
There's so much bread got in the water, I can't even taste it this time. But it, 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 besides that, it tastes good. It's not a bad burger. I, I would recommend it. I mean, rather you, you don't mind having it not cooked out good or cooked better than it was or put it on a barbecue, whatever you like. It's a good, I would say it's a good burger, so I'll give it three stars. You know, I mean, some people may give it three and a half stars or two and a half stars, whatever, but three stars is good. Like, a, you know, like from, you know, like I say in my other vlogs, one star is bad, two stars is fair, three stars is good, four stars is excellent, five stars is, is extraordinary. So I'll give it three stars. It's, it's a good burger. I would, I, you know, I, I recommend it. You just give it a shot. You don't like it. There's all burgers I'm, I'm sure you may like. I got vegan. But I mean, this is something I would say try for sure. Look what, you know, there's a bunch of corn in it. Like you can see there's corn in it. I don't know if you can see it. That fell a piece of bread is falling off. And you know, it's ketchup on it, like I told you. You could put all the things on, you know, vegan dressing or any kind of dressing you want, or I don't know, we put mayonnaise, whatever you like. Like you could put tomatoes. And so, you know, really make it even taste better than it is if you, you know, put more ingredients on it or condiments. Without a doubt, I, 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 I recommend it. So I would say, you know, give it a try. You can't lose it. I would say you would, uh, more, nine out of ten people would like it. I can't see, even if you're not a lover of vegan food. Or vegan burgers, I would say that most people say it's not bad. I mean, I can't see how anybody would say it's really bad, but you know, that's, that's how it is in this world. But I think most people really, you know, say it's it's not a bad burger. But it might, you know. But I mean, if you're vegan and this is one of the, I would say one of the options you could eat, I think you would enjoy it. So that's my review on it, on this, you know, vlog for this Baba burger. And I hope you enjoyed it. And um, before I end, like always in my vlogs, think positive and feel positive, and um, your life will change, you know. And um, if you could, um, if you're not following me, please subscribe. Take my bell, share this video to your friends, family, whoever you could, and, you know. And uh, thank you for listening. All right, thank you for um, thank you for watching. If you came this far, and like I say, think positive, feel positive, and be happy. Okay, bye for now.